but also know that I acted in what I felt were the best interests for all at the time. And truly for the interest of time itself. Margaret Adler. Oh, <laughs> I've had, oh, I've seriously had like dreams about this. Finding a secret, digging it up, it turning out to be a mechanical unicorn. Yeah, we've all had the mechanical unicorn dream, but I think I'm ready just to go home, to be totally face up with you. Okay. Welcome back to Oxenfree, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, I guess I quit the game before it saved, and then I had to do all that again. But here we are, we're back. So, I don't know where I'm going right now. Oops, I'm going to the cliffs right now. <laughs> Woo! Come on, Nona! Okay, so yeah, last time we left off, uh, scavenger hunt. And... I don't know. Let's keep looking out, uh, looking over the island. Let's see. Wrong thingy. Here we are. Oh, cool. Adler's uh, number station is one forty point one. Um. So we have an entire map of the island. We've got hidden stuff to find with the new radio. And we don't know where our friends are. They could be at Harden Tower, but they're not showing up. Also, we don't know where Clarissa is. So, I guess the first things first is we find Clarissa. Did we even find the gate key? What? Oh, okay, so the radio must have been the gate key. Which is the 140.1 to the, to the Adler Estate that we were at last time. Okay, so we're going to go down to Beacon Beach just to see what's down there. And then we'll just make our way back up. Sure, that's as good a plan as any. <laughs> Alex, why are you wearing that jacket? It's like 75 degrees and the sun's out, you know? And I thought you said you were going to go swimming anyway. Uh, the sun the sun's not... not out. The sun is, I guess it barely came out just now. But see, this is when I get punished for watching the weatherman. He said it was going to be like overcast. He said there was a chance for clouds. Hey, Michael, we didn't bring drinks. Did we? I thought we said we'd bring drinks. Am I, did I get stuck in time or something? No, I know. Day's going by like crazy fast, right? That's I not what I meant. I feel just accosted by those soccer players. Hey, it's called No, I mean, in this time period. Ah, oh, jeez, you're hitting the existential nostalgia trip already? I guess, uh, Alex, I would have been happier in the 70s. Jeez. 70s, it's like the worst time. Where's, where's Jonas? Jonas? Who's Jonas? Is someone else coming? Yeah, is that a friend of yours? Uh, I just, <sighs> never mind, I guess. Okay, Clarissa, take a note. Remind me to check the yearbook for a Jonas, so I can make fun of Alex's secret boyfriend. Oh, goodness. Noted. Today turned out to be a flawless day. It really did. Yeah, no, it did. It really did. I wanted to bring a kite, but thought you'd laugh at me. This is really quite insane, what's happening right now. I'm just sorry that apparently nobody realizes how insane this is. <laughs> right. I know, right? Nobody really appreciates it when conditions are this good. Oh, uh. wow, it is... Perfect ice cream and tennis weather. That is rare. And you guys keep talking like this is normal, but it's not. But I guess it's fine. We're going to the beach just like I wanted, so. It's been a spell since we did something, right? I feel like I haven't talked to you in a while. How have you been? What's been going on? How's classes? How's. What's his face, Mr. Collins English? Truthfully, I've, um, I've... Ah, sorry, I think, yeah, I, <laughs> I accidentally left my phone on the ferry, because I do things like that. <laughs> oh, God, you idiot. Go get it before it leaves. When I get back, I want to hear an Alex story. <laughs> yeah, sure. Well, can't I just come with you? I'll take two seconds. Think of something to tell me. Oh, boy. So, this is sad. Uh, 
If I were to ask you if you were, um, past Clarissa, that wouldn't make any sense to you, right? Past Clarissa? Like, like, am I past the name Clarissa? Or, I guess I don't understand. Uh, forget it. Uh, it's all right. I don't even know what to say. <laughs> okay. Um, I'm glad we could all do stuff today. I'm glad yeah. you're cool with it, I mean. I know you guys are really close, and like, I know it can be annoying when somebody starts keeping all their time for their girlfriend or whatever. So, I think it would be cool if we could like, continue to do things together. It doesn't matter, Clarissa, do what you want. No, it does matter, it does matter. I want you to feel good about the situation, you know? I, I want this to be good. Michael, uh, he loves you, like, a lot. I'm sure you know that, but he talks about you all the time. <laughs> oh, Alex did this, and Alex let the frogs out in science class. Isn't she hilarious? He just, uh, he thinks you're a cool girl. Thanks for uh, telling me. Yeah, of course. I had to fight the skipper for it, but he didn't reckon how many squats I could do. What's it up to, <laughs> six? Only on burrito days. On non-burrito days, it's like eight. Actually, Clarissa and I had a nice chat while you were away. Kinda sorry to see you back so soon, to be honest. Mm -hmm. Oh, really? I'm sure Alex sold you on how I lock her in the basement and treat her like a shaved monkey. What? What I heard was you trap her in the greenhouse. Yeah, well, it changes month to month. No, it was perfectly fine. Perfectly amicable. Amiable. It means the same thing. All right, sorry. So, I actually really want a cold something, so I'm gonna run into town and get like a soda. Anybody want anything? Um, nah, I'm good. Uh, sure. Uh, yeah, get me a drink too. Anything. Sure, I'll be back. Okay, I'm here. What's the story? I want the news. I want the Alex first edition. What's going on? Things, Things are bad, actually. Mom and Dad aren't great, and I'm like a hair trigger away from spinning off this planet. Hey, hey, look. First of all, Mom and Dad are Mom and Dad. They fight a lot, but they're whatever. Everything always blows over. It's gonna be fine. You're too young. We're too young to worry about marital discord. It's not gonna be fine. It's not gonna be fine. I, I know how this goes. I have insider information let's just call it okay right Look, right just because Janie's parents got a divorce and made poker nights super uncomfortable doesn't mean ours have to too all right and look i know this was supposed to be our day but i completely forgot i promised clarissa i'd do something with her so thanks for chaperoning i know it's not what you had in mind so but i owe you what do you see in her really okay here's okay tuesday night she dragged me to a comedy club for open mic, shoved me on stage, and then proceeded what? to curse out the entire bar when they didn't laugh at my horrible jokes. And that <laughs> was a Tuesday, so that's what I see in her. That sounds awful. Like, I think I've had stress dreams more relaxing than that. I guess you had to be there then. It's important to me that you like Clarissa, Alex, so tell me the truth. What do you really think of her? Uh... I don't know. God, do what you want, man. Don't ask me for advice. <laughs> okay, I'm taking that as endorsement, just so you know. You know, I never noticed. That's a good-looking jacket. I should ask for it back. I don't like my new one. Feels like I got shoes on my arms or something. <sighs> you know what, Bucko? I need it more than you. <laughs> Bucko? You haven't called me that in years. Oh, boy. Catching up with a ghost. Oh, yeah. Alex? Ugh. Are you... Alright, are you back with me now? Man, no. you've been acting like a... I don't even know how to put it. Like a bird just flitting around in circles for ten minutes. Oh, I what? I to, like, slap you or scream or something. It's been not fun to watch in light of everything. Nona, I, I just saw... I think I just saw my brother Mike. What? How? Where? Here? Is he... was it like a... I don't... I don't know what to call it. A vision? I was... Uh, it was like those time jumps we're sometimes having, right? This was... it's like we've been having ripples, and this was a wave. I was bumped all the way back to when Michael was still alive. Right now? I guess we're going to Epiphany Fields instead. Wait. We are 
are in Epiphany Field. I could go back down to the beach. But we're already up here. No, wait. Okay, wait, no. Uh, let's go to the beach. Huh? Hold on. I didn't know Maggie grew up in Maine. There's a similar statue of a soldier in Maine where I grew up. My memory of it is... Uh, my memory of it is, I think, part of the reason why I said yes when the army recruited me out of college despite my family's protestations. Anna, my closest friend from childhood, was, of course, thrilled at the possibility of my escape. I anonymously started the petition in 1975 to have this one made after the daughter of Kanaloa crewman Francis Salter asked... I don't know why. A marker, maybe, for the hope I once had to help people. Okay. Oh, I can't go back. Yay! I guess I'm going this way. We're running! Hey, why aren't you at the tower? Yeah, serious this one. got a little antsy. Weird stuff was playing on the radio. That voice said I had a mother's laugh. What does that even mean? Anyways, are we happy? We are happy. We got a new radio that's supposed to open doors and gates in some magical way. Oh, thank God. I was getting nervous that you would have walked all that way and then not found anything. Seeing as how it was my advice to uh, do the whole thing. But it worked out, so great. Yeah, Clarissa's gone though. Gone? Gone like dead? Or no, no. I like, no. guess there was a, what'd you guys call it? Like a time loop thing? She pretty much got transmogrified to someplace else. It's sad that any of those words make any sense to me, but... Yeah, should we maybe look for her, possibly? Even if the boat plan works, we shouldn't leave her here. Listen, right. if we have the key, which is apparently this radio, then let's just go to the house and see. And if it looks like we can leave that way, then we'll go on a Clarissa hunt. <sighs> All right. I think you're supposed to use the radio to tune into the gate, right, Alex? Okay, sure. We'll do it that way. So, are you gonna try the gate thing, or I I'm just the getting will here? Open this somehow. Hopefully. Give it a whirl. One forty point one. The, am I doing it right? Forty point one. Mm. How far up does a one fifty? Hey guys, it's not working. What am I supposed to do? One forty. Why is it? Oh, wait. It's because I don't know how to count. What was I doing? 104? I feel so dumb. No, it is 140. I don't understand. Yeah, no, I don't understand. It's not working. Maybe I need to go somewhere else. Where are you going? I thought we... Aren't we sticking to the... The find the boat and paddle away game plan? Yeah. Oh, I'm not leaving. Just, you know, doing my thing. First of all, it's thang. And secondly, what does that even mean? Well, we'll be here when you're finished. Darn right you will, because I'm the protagonist. Let me do my thing. Even if this... Thing I'm doing isn't working. Why is this thing I'm doing working? Hmm.
Huh? Why did that work? Oh, neat. Yeah. I wasn't just Please guessing. Have a boat. Please have a boat. Please have a boat. I wasn't just guessing at all. Not me. Happy thoughts. Yeah, happy thoughts. Yeah, happy thoughts. Something wrong, Jonah? You guys made up yet? You better have. A bunch of dummies. Dunch of bummies. Jesus, that house is huge. That Isn't lady really though? knew how to live. It's like the Chateau de Adler. <sighs> there is something up with her. She has this giant house. She's burying like secret messages all over the place. I mean, this is crazy. Yeah, and we can leave it to Scrappy Do or whoever to figure it out. What's a scrappy do? <laughs> yeah, but we could figure it out. Aren't you the least but curious? Just a little. There's not going to be a sunken pirate ship at the end of this, Alex. It's just a wrecked submarine. Yeah, and if you're really so anxious, you can come back on your own time. I just want to get home. But there could be stuff and junk. Oh, I'm in the basement. It's going down. Basement. She made a lot of... What should I call these? Slides? They're not videos. Um, silent memories? <laughs> sure. Huh. Ren, you were right. There's like a ledger here. The Adler family does own the island. And here's a combination for a padlock to a... Chest is all it says. 29, hmm. 18... 54. I will Chest. not remember that. Have you seen one yet? <sighs> Negative, but maybe I just missed it. There's something in here. Just looks like vacation slides or something. Hmm. Okay, well. I guess I got a combination for a chest. Hopefully Alex remembers, because I will not. Oh. Oh, it's like a it's like a boat that needs keys. There are no oars. And before we go crazy, it's not it wasn't with Maggie's stuff back at the office, like with the radio? No. We looked through all of her stuff, I think. Huh. Mm. Well, uh what's plan B if we can't find it? Um, plan B was for keys, they they have to be in the house. Right. Movers or her family, you know? That's as good a guess as any. Sometimes when I lock myself out of my house, I'll just... I can't help but just stare at the deadbolt trying to, like, hypnotize it to open or something. You ever do that? Um, not really. But we can try that now if you think it'll help. <laughs> it's a radio lock. Hmm. The woman sure did love her antiquated security. Well, then this one must be 140.1. Was I wrong again? Ugh. Shut up. Nifty gizmo. Sure is. Let's go in. Finally. Carissa, oh, God. Jesus. oh my what? Like Maggie Adler's dead body. How'd something. you even get in here? How do you get in here? The door was locked. Do you have like a radio? No, I don't have a radio. The kitchen window was open. Oh. Kitchen window? Where? In the back? In the kitchen? I don't believe you. These windows don't even they don't work like that. How would you know you've never been here? Look, Clarissa's here, so everyone's here now. We can just... Everyone's okay, all right? 
That's a good thing. Yeah, let's just find the keys to the boat or a phone or whatever and just find a way home. I promise we can all keep talking and or fighting at school on Monday. Yes. I don't care what she says. Just everyone keep your eye on her. Yeah, I just might climb through the kitchen window again. Who knows? Okay, we get it. Haha, -ha, carry on. Everybody find something and hope that it helps. Okay. Fine. <sighs> it's been disconnected. Of course it Bummer. has. Man, she owned enough books. It's mostly math, I think. Ergodic thermodynamics. And <laughs> religion. Sheesh, okay, there's a lot of... Okay, we get it. She liked the smell of paper. Fascinating insight. We'll all even... miss her dearly. I'm not talking to you. I'm just talking out loud. You can only ever talk out loud. Oh my god. Oh my god. Ugh. She's a bit insufferable. Just a little bit. Oh, it's a... It's a draft of her letter that she left in the office. To whom it should concern. She left notes everywhere, she said. Hidden with secret signals. She was an odd one, I'll give her that. But, you know, cool in a way. Maybe she was up to something, you ever think of that? I mean, she's wrapped up in this thing somehow. Well, maybe, but also things don't have to make sense. Sometimes stuff just happens, and that's the end of it. I mean, I guess. Wait, have you seen this? It's like a, a star map or a diagram of planets or something. Yeah, why would she need anything like a map of the universe? I mean, it's not like she's bouncing stuff off satellites for a job. Or maybe they were back then. What do I know? Maybe they needed to chart uh, signals through space or something? Yeah, maybe. Hmm. Are we talking to aliens, not oh, ghosts? that's an attic? thought it was like a cat's toy or something. Wanna come up? Yeah, sure. Oh, a chest. Look at that. Also, you had something to say, right? How are you doing? How are you doing? Ugh. Look, Jonas, are we, like, okay? I mean, because of the whole taking not you to town thing. Right. <sighs> I'm not going to pretend it didn't bother me a little, but it'd be stupid to, like, tonight has been bad enough. I'm not going to crab about that. I mean, are you, like, mad at me or something? Ugh. Right? Well, maybe a little. Well, I... I'm sorry for whatever it is, I guess. And if it's about Ren, then tell him not to be a jackass anymore and we'll be fine, I'm sure. Okay, so you're obviously still mad. Ooh, fine. You know what? This might be the, um, the chest that takes that combination. Yeah, what was it? 29, 18, 54. It's a lot of radios and those containers we saw at the town office. Oh, and like a map of the caverns. She's written here, tune into the source. What do you think that means? She couldn't have known about the ghosts, right? Tune into the source. It, it's probably something about the special radios, you know? Huh. I mean, maybe. This, ah, the boat keys. Oh. We got them. Great. Perfecto. Perfecto. All right, we got keys for the boat. Where? Uh, Jonas found them in a chest upstairs. Yeah, so he did. Say thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. I was just saying it. It's not directed at you or anything. Okay. Oh, come on. Oh, yeah. to this, all right? I'm not playing along anymore. Oh, just come down, and we'll drink to our future. <laughs> come down, okay? It'll be all right, I promise. <sighs> Ren, are you... Are you all right? We're in a... We're in a time loop thing. Darn it. Nona, come on, honey. It's time to motor. <laughs> Come 
on, Jonas. I, I really need you. Don't blink out on me now. Ah, jeez. These ghosts or whatever are just annoying now at this point. Ah, there you are. Ah. Now we imagine you're a bit confused. But don't fret. This will be the final part of your training, Alex. Training? All training is supervised by very skilled instructors. Training? I, I don't want to be trained. What are you signed up for this, Alexandra? In the caverns, you tuned in to our signal. So please, I cannot bear your excuses, offspring. I you wish I hadn't tuned into that stupid thing, okay? If I knew what it was gonna do, do you... Do you really think I would have even brought this radio? Shh. It's okay. Everything, Everything will be, be fine. fine. The test is easy. We will speak of something we see in the house, and you will go and find it. No! See? As simple and good humor as, as your mother's apple. apple. I want to play this. Just tell me what's happening. Refusal to cooperate will incur grim penalties, I'm afraid, but it's your choice. Ugh. Now, let's start with the softball. I spy with my little eye. What? Radiation. What do you mean? Of course the time will appear. So. Ah. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Oh, I'm sorry, child. No. You weren't even close. No, no. Stop it. Come on. No, it's, it's my fault. I the little ones up and hit the silk. If you'd paid attention, you'd have noticed the television set right by my side, the little X-ray emitting death machine. But right now, you'd be wise to think of radiation. In other sense. Pay attention. What are you even talking about? I spy with my little eye a notch. Let's make this a little harder, okay? Uh, what do you mean a knot? What does that mean? Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. Ah! Oh, Alexandra, what a disappointment you've turned out to be. Jonas, come on, snap out of it. Oh, your new brother. Gone to first light. This isn't their fault. Bring them back. They'll come back when you learn their purpose, child. It's time for the bonus round, Alex, so stay quick. This is what you really want to find. Uh, I spy with my little eye memory. a picture of a memory. Be fast now. The, this the one? picture of, of... I guess it's Maggie Adler and somebody. Is this it? Yes, very nice. That's Margaret Adler and her friend Emma. You see, you and your schoolyard chums are experiencing, well... This has sort of happened before. Maggie and Anna tried to sport with us many years ago, and, well, only one survived. But in the process, we discovered a way for us to return, so to speak. It just takes a little time, and a far-reaching tolerance for the ignorance. Okay, if we- if I help you, will you stop whatever it is that you're doing with my friends? Ah, uh, well... There's the rub. They're not an eternal recurrence. The waves. It's the waves, we think. And we will use the waves to absorb into your friends so the sunlight blooms into flowers. And we will grow. And we will engulf. Wait, what... what happens to them after you're... absorbed? Their form will exist with us inside. It will be a swap, you see, of... essences, I guess you could call them. We tried no. too quickly with Anna, but now we know to wait and soak. No. We had to keep you here on the island. It will be a great honor, Alex, really, to carry us through this life. No. And on to the next. There has to be another way. I mean, just maybe, I mean, maybe I can do something with the radio. We never had our time. It was ripped from us. We watched the universe's conception fly to its demise over and over and over again. You don't know what it's been like. There's no excuse for stealing our... our souls. Well, it's the only excuse you're gonna get. When our vessel dashed on the rocks, we had until dawn, and so will you. We would spend our time wisely, and... we thank you for your good service. Ah! So, I'm kinda screwed. So how much time do I have exactly?
Oh, another tape player. Tell Michael he should go out on his own. Okay, seriously, who are you? Huh. <sighs> I have an idea of who that is. That might be my past self trying to save Michael, perhaps? I don't remember that tape player being there. So we can go on. <laughs> I I think I'm gonna be sick. Oh, that Before, makes sense. It wasn't a ha! dream or a vision or something. You and Clarissa standing in the living room just now, was it? Clarissa. Uh, no, but I wish it was a dream. Usually, there's a lot more talking horses. Mm. Oh, and by the way, next time, put some actual effort into the game, pretty please. Hey, I, I was like trying. Was shoving spiders down my throat. Yeah. I'm sorry, all right? I, I tried my best. I mean, when things are jumping all around, it's tough to even know what she was talking about. So, I mean, Christ, if Clarissa was whisked away to the cave by nuclear submarine monsters, then... I mean, the plan has to be to retrieve her, right? I'm still going to call them ghosts, if that's okay. A ghost is... Clarissa is only, like, one slice of the problem. We're all infected or whatever, so we need to rip the issue off like a bandage all at once. Okay, great, yeah, but... How do we do that? Well, uh, a good question. Maggie, ah, I think Maggie Adler might have had some sort of a plan or a, a scheme or something to fix what's going on. What possible plan could Maggie Adler have? First of all, she's dead. And second of all, she was like the island Mother Goose. She didn't know- She wrote in her journal or something or other about tuning into the source of the problem in the cave. And I think she was talking about the ghosts. Well, if we're going to the cave, Oh, actually, I forgot. I saw the entrance has been caved in since you guys went inside. All right. Oh, yeah? I know there are a whole bunch of secret communist bomb-fearing tunnels dug into this place during the 1950s. And Maggie has loads of film about military stuff in her basement, so... Maybe there's a way back into the cave through one of those, you're thinking? <sighs> Let's take a look. Let's take a look. What kind of name is a Fippany Fields, anyway? Wait. No. Is it a Fippany? It's... Uh, it's it's, it's epiphany, epiphany field. you guys. Oh, that makes more sense. <laughs> Did you just have an epiphany about that? Okay, don't time loop me. 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 Okay, we're good. There we go. There's already something in here. Experiments and findings of experienced phenomena, January 52. Awesome. Mm. Oh, man. If this turns out to be just prehistoric home videos, yeah. I'm sure this is just... God, the... it's just the first thing. Just yeah. give it a second to warm up, will yeah, you? Come on, you guys. Okay, we're getting warmer, I think. So, if you look at the, like, lines or whatever, the bomb shelter should lead right into the cave, just like from another angle. According to this, at least. Oh, so it does. That doesn't really help us, Nona. I mean, a bomb shelter is pretty much designed to keep stuff out. Hmm. Oh, what? She knew about these things? Apparently. Wow, that's crazy. It says that to fix a temporal tear, that's a mouthful, in the Not cave, really. we would need to transpose to the other side and tune into the source within itself. Wouldn't okay, we then be we're not trapped? Doing that, right? Good question. Yeah, that's that's going a little above, above and beyond. Maybe, I don't know. Maybe she was wrong and it didn't work. Maybe she tried and it didn't work. Well, something better work, or, or we're boned. Or uh, we're boned. Precisely. precisely. Okay. Oh, sorry. This is like this looks like the end, but from the from the wrong film thing. No, no, no. Wait. This is something I actually remember from that stupid radio tour thing because it like sounded so weird. What do you it's mean? called the call and response system. It unlocks the bomb shelter. This is showing us how to do oh. it. See? It says when someone sends an emergency signal from the catbird station in the woods and the receiving station confirms it. 
It's like a connected response thing. Brilliant! Really? It's good enough for me. Alex and me will head through the woods, do the, um, call part. You and Ren can hang by the door to the bomb shelter and open it when it's ready. Uh... Can we just... I mean, can we just, like, think this plan through for, like, one minute before running off half-cocked? <laughs> Everyone oh my god. That, right? <sighs> yes. Don't we need, like, access codes or something like that? Actually, I doubt it. It'll probably be tied to, like, the military radios and, well, we stole them, so... Well, the system works. Yeah, I guess so. Use the response station to open the bomb shelter. So we go all the way up to what? Relay point? Okay, well, let's get started, I guess. All right, break. And if anything goes wrong, please don't tell me. I won't want to know. That's great. Well, now I'm going to run over there and specifically tell you at the first drop of bad news. No! <laughs> I'm glad we're all still friends. Even though Jonas and Ren like to be butts to each other. And I seriously don't know why. Let's see. Now I can go to the beach, but there's no point. Okay, so... Uh, yeah, let's just go. Huh? Go. Okay, come on. <laughs> when I ask you to go, I mean for you to go. Okay. Oh, no. Whoa. I don't like that. Alex. Alex, okay. Are you are you back to normal? Well, uh, huh. I just saw it, it, it was like a premonition, I think. And, and I know that sounds whatever, but this must be what it's like when people say they do that cuz I kind of just saw Ren drowning. Okay, okay. Just take it easy for a second. You went all red-eyed like when we get possessed. Oh, what? I can't let that matter right now. Ren, look, I just know he needs me. I mean, me seeing him in trouble must mean he's, like, actually in trouble, right? Not really. I think it's just an effect of the, uh, possession or something. Like, look, when I went under, I saw, but not really, you on a beach with a battleship. What? Oh, is that really what you saw when you were possessed? Yeah, and I'm sure when it happened to him, Ren saw his own weird stuff, too. So, I don't know, but I think he's okay. Let's keep on to the station. We can talk to him from there anyway. Okay. Uh, you better be telling the truth. Let me see. We are going... Uh, right, yeah. It's Toy Woods Bridge Stand uh, Campgrounds Relay Point. <laughs> no, look, it kind of made sense. Wait, hey, guys, guys, uh, wait, did I get the plan wrong? Because if I got it right, no, you didn't get it wrong. You're supposed to be yellow brick roading it to the wood station right about now. We're just taking this way, that's all. What, right, the scenic route? Everything's the scenic route. There's no quicker way. Right, uh, come on. Okay, well, we'll be here. The thing I don't get is. What if everyone at their respective stations were on, like, a lunch break or something when the bomb started falling? What would open the door then? I don't think you're allowed to take lunch breaks when you're on active nuclear annihilation watch duty, so it'd probably never come up. Yeah, okay. You're probably right. You're probably right. I am going the right way, right? <laughs> I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure I'm going the right way. Well, I'm just glad we saw Ren on our way up. Also, yeah, this was clearly the faster way. I don't need to go to Fort Milner. She keeps stopping and I don't know why. 
I don't need to go to the comm tower. Toey Woods. You know what time it is? Uh... It's four in the morning. Which is usually about the time everyone decides if they're going to bed or ordering another three pizzas. Yeah? What's your vote usually in uh, that situation? Uh, pizza. Never leave pizza on the table. It's like getting 11 in blackjack. Just double down. Don't even think about it. <laughs> you think this tuning into the tear thing's gonna work? Like, really? It really doesn't matter if I think it's gonna work. It's sort of all we have, and we're running out of time. Yeah. It is all we have, yeah. I just... I just wish I felt like the ghosts were concerned that their plan won't work. Yeah, I just same. feel like they're pretty confident. Like they know by sunrise they're all gonna be shopping for school supplies. Yeah, well, you know who else was confident? Hitler. <laughs> and look how he ended up. Dead. With syphilis. Oh, true. I think that this um, stuff is getting pulled in from, like, their time or something. This is so weird. Um, yeah, it's not exactly a good omen. I think we're running out of runway here. True enough. Let's go. Ugh. Yeah, see, nothing to it. Nothing to it. Bridge stand. Go. Yep. On with the bridge stand. How quickly does time move? What time is dawn? Oh, I feel like I'm going to get everyone killed. Ah, this is not great. Now the station's up at the top of the hill. Yep. I hope this works. Same. What? Okay, so let's see. We can just go keep going up. Now the station's up at the top of the hill. I hope this works. Uh, <sighs> oh, not this again. We're in another time maze thing. Uh, okay. We were due. It's been like a minute since the last one. Yeah. Okay, so nothing in there. Do I keep going up or should I go back down? Let's go up. Now the station's up at the top of the hill. Okay, so I that's not working. Works. Yep, I am also hope that. <laughs> okay, okay. Oh Ren. cool. No no what happened? What's wrong with Ren? Ren He's... he had an accident. He... he died. I couldn't... <sighs> Don't no, worry no, about come it. On. Clarissa was dead too, but like bunny ears dead, not dead dead. Because uh, yeah, apparently yeah, yeah. killing yourself doesn't actually do anything here. Right. Alex. What? It's the truth. Well, it's the truth, Jonas. And I'm not gonna stand here and fall for one of these I'm dead. No, I'm not. Shuffleboard swaps again. Yeah. Come on. Come let's on. skip to the last chapter. I know right. what's gonna happen. He, he drowned. Right. He took a fall. Right. I don't know. He just, he just stopped. Uh huh. I mean, does it really matter what happened? Either way, done is done. Fix Ren, whatever you want to call it. I know you're doing it. Just fix it. It's not us doing it, dear. We weren't lying. Uh -huh. The time loops, as you've taken to calling them, which we do find so adorable, mm -hmm. are of your own making. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, sure. Just like you infesting us like lice isn't your fault either. Mm. That we have and will own up to. But the other stuff, that we're afraid is on you. Alex, we know you're in charge and we know your plan. And we also know that your plan won't work. It never does. So we have a proposition for you. A oh. deal. A bargain, really. And you should... Closing the tear in the cave might work. You, you don't know that for sure. 
We do know that for sure. We've seen others try, we've seen you try. So pay attention. It's already over for Clarissa. She's gone. We'll pilot her through the rest of existence, and there's nothing you can do to change that. But if you agree to let us take her, let her go quietly and without fuss, you won't slaughter the rest of your friends, like young Reginald here. We leave the rest of you cattle alone. We only really need the one, anyway. No, no, no way. I'm saving everyone. Everyone is coming home with me. We're all getting out of here. Yeah. <laughs> Courage is not always the way, dear. It's always my way. You don't have much time left. Do you know how we know you don't have much time left? Hmm. How do you know? Fine. Shoot. How do you know? We know because we can be Jonas for this long, and his soul is as quiet as an empty church. Just never say we didn't provide you all the rules. Okay. So now we've got the tape recorders back. Um I know he was your best friend, Alex. I I'm sorry. I don't I don't know what happened. One minute he was there and then he was just gone. It's okay, Nona. You you didn't do anything wrong. I know it's not your fault. Of course it's not your fault. I didn't know him that well, but I like what I'd gotten to know. I'm sorry. It's... I shouldn't. It's colossally stupid of me to talk about him like that with you here. This is... He was more important. No, no, come on. We can still crack this. I do not believe... I, I won't that he's gone forever. I, I just won't. I wish I had your faith in things. Oh. It's a tiny thing, but I hope he knew that I liked him. And I don't know if he did. He hopes you did. I think that's enough. Like I said, it's a tiny thing. I wonder if there's a sequence to this. There we go. The station's up at the top of the... Ugh. God. That was exactly my mouth feels like I just ate a tree. A tree? Those, they tried to make like a deal with me for Clarissa's life. I didn't take it, of course, but I don't know. I, I just thought you should know. God, that must mean they're getting desperate or something. That if they had any like power over the situation, they wouldn't try to work out a compromise. Right. Anyway. Okay. Uh -oh. Anyone there? We're we're working on it. What are they? Oh, they're, um, they're somehow, I guess they're somehow broadcasting or something from the, uh, station speakers. Right. <laughs> Are you guys at the station? Anybody? They're both alive. Jonas? That's all I care about. Jonas? God. Punch Alex if you can yeah. do this. No, that's a, that's a bonus too. Seriously, right in the throat. Jonas, don't listen. Oh, goodness. Am I going the right way? I hope I am. We're all set here for the, uh, the thing? Machinery, speak and hug, or whatever we're doing. Speak and yeah, hug. Do it. Time's a waste. Radio locked. I keep forgetting this thing is like that. actually wasted. Okay, like I feel my body wasted away. No, it's it's okay if you're like dealing with stuff. We had to deal with stuff. What stuff? The uh, when I almost kind of slipped and fell off the bridge. Oh my God, you guys. That... No, it was the. It was psychotic to watch. Hello, we're here. Yeah, come on. Hello. Hi, hi, oh, hi, hello. hi, hi. This is Edward Island's emergency. How may I help you? Oh, if goodness. You're being sat on by a very large burglar. Just mash the dial with your fist, please. Oh, thank God. I'd like to report a poltergeist. <laughs> they've come into my house. They've shaved all my cats. They look better in my mittens. Oh, I just need any and all advice you can give me. Well, first, everyone just shut up. <laughs> Play dress up phone time when you get home. We got work to do. All right, Mr. No Fun. No Fun? What is that? Swedish? Man, you guys are a real comedy team here. Stunning. <laughs> the wit on display. Just trying to lighten things up. Signal verified. Shelter TF1 open. Nice. I guess it worked. Great. Okay, we'll meet you there. Right. 
See you at the shelter. Yep. Over and out. Okay, close the time hole and save the day. That's all we gotta do. Sounds simple enough. Let's go, Jonah. Alright, so we do this and then we jump. Ah. Hmm. Yeah, he'll he'll catch up. He's just being a little slow, that's all. See? He caught up. I have an idea, Mr. Jordan. Couldn't we have him reborn? Oh no, come on. Okay, we're taking Jonas, don't what? turn freaky now. Okay, 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 I'm Jesus Christ, I really hate that. But I'm I think, um... What is it, like, what does it feel like when that happens? Is you forget stuff, really. Like, what you're supposed to be doing, or... I usually forget my dad's name to start. And then it snowballs into not remembering how to walk or talk, and... But you, like, see stuff, right? Oh. Like, when I saw Michael on the beach, Yeah, I, you... I see stuff, but it's like, I don't know, they're like dreams. They just dissolve when I'm back. Look, it's scary, needless to say, when I, like, drown or whatever in my own body, and it's starting to feel like, just, like, how do I say this? Because I don't... It's okay, Jonas. Just say what's on your brain. Mm. I just want to say, I just, I think it would have been cool, us living together for, for whatever, senior year. And I'm just glad I met you, that's all. Mm. I'm just glad we met. <laughs> I'm glad, too, okay? So, there. It's out in the open. We're both glad. Okay, good. So, that's it. And now we can go back to the whole escaping and trying to live another day thing. Yeah, let's finish strong now. No half-acidness at the end. Mm. We got this, right? Right, we got this? We got this, right? I think we got this. I know we got this. Right? Uh, it's already five. How do we take an hour? Okay, I'm gonna. I'm just gonna say one thing, and then I promise it'd be the last time I bring it up tonight. But oh yeah, you know you screwed up with Ashley at the concert, right? I mean, what? it's not a giant thing, but still. Who's uh, who's Ash? Oh, oh. You mean Amanda, my really good friend Amanda, who's moving away forever. That Amanda? Yeah, that Amanda who stole her mom's car. And I don't care if you didn't know she didn't have permission to take it, cause whatever, fine. But you knew you didn't have permission to go to that show. <sighs> Just tell me it's the last time I hear about you stealing a car. However inadvertently, my little heart can't handle the excitement. Mm, nope, not promising that. What's the point in living if not to boost cars for an underworld criminal empire? Mm. I guess I can't answer that. Oh, and I wanted to say, um, <laughs> per your advice, I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna really, um, like, commit to Clarissa. <laughs> that sounds dumb, like I'm pinning her or something. Wow, big man on campus. I don't know why I said that. Big step, <laughs> that's what I mean. Big step. Eh, it's not a big deal. I'm just letting you know, so... <laughs> I don't know. I don't know why. I just wanted to tell you. Come on, let's get to the sentry before the last boat comes. I gotta get the uh, visual aid for the history project. And then I just gotta write the stupid essay. What history project? They still make you do, like, work with so little left in the year? Unfortunately, this is, it's just like a town history thing for civics, you know? So it's forced me to kind of, I don't know, and I mean, it's funny, I don't know if I even want to be here next year. It's just all so flat. Same people, the same expressions. Well, if you leave, I'd certainly miss you. Yeah, no, I'd miss you too. It's just that everybody here knows me, you know? I know you think I have it on easy street, but people looking at you all the time, wanting evidence that it's good, that they lived here, that good things can happen to people that are from here, it can get to be a real drag. Like, how about somebody else be captain of whatever for once? Give me a rest. Just don't put so much pressure on yourself, Michael. Who cares what they think? You're gonna... You're gonna do what you're gonna do. I'm gonna do what I'm gonna do. Yes, I will. <laughs> uh, let's head back before Karen Strands is here. You know, when we saw Uncle Pete last month, I wanted to ask him, because he, he got out moving to New York. And I asked him if it was hard leaving. Know what he said? Um... 
Oh god, Michael, I have no idea. I mean, knowing Uncle Peter, he was probably three sheets to the wind. He said the hardest part was deciding what to take with him and what to leave behind. I thought it was, I don't know, for him, <laughs> kind of almost touching. Oh my, how profound. I can't believe Uncle Pete's a mere failed actor and not teaching philosophy at Berkeley. Oh, shut up. <laughs> <laughs> I cannot believe I had to pick you up from the police station because of Grand Theft Auto. I mean, that is too funny. <laughs> oh, shut up. What? I didn't want to get closer to that cliff. <laughs> I wonder what would have happened. Would he have fallen? I have no idea. <laughs> I wasn't going to find out. At least not on this playthrough. Alex? Uh. Shut up, shut... Uh. <sighs> you got, you know, you went bad again. I couldn't get you out of it. We should really, we should get this done now. I saw... I saw Michael again. I just... I'm sorry. When I'm there, I just get sucked into it like nothing happened. Come on. It's all right. I think I can hear Ren and Nona down there. Okay. Okay. Half an hour, right? Sunrise is probably at six, so... Let's no, go. No, I just always do the poster. I mean, you get the option, right? The... There's an option to make a poster? Oh, definitely. Whose class are you in? Miss Underhill's. Oh... If you get... No, actually it'll still work, even with her. <laughs> no way. Yes way. It'll work. You guys, uh, doing okay? Yeah, it's... We're fine. But Ren, wait, seriously. In AP English, all you had to do was make a fake book cover poster at the end of the semester? Yeah, but the trick is you have to claim you're a kinesthetic learner. I have to make something with my hands, teacher. Or... That's... Huh, that's pretty... That's good. You got Moxie. I'll have to do that next year. Well, I don't know. I kind of maybe ruined it for the rest of you since I used that excuse in like five classes already. <laughs> <laughs> I... I want to get this off my chest. Just... Something happened to us tonight, Alex. Something broke. I don't know if it was the ghosts or whatever, but... You've been acting like... Not you. Who, me? Ren. No. I just... I don't know. Well, I tried. I mean... I don't know what else I could have done, man. This night has been... Awful non-stop. It was a lot to juggle. I know. I don't I don't know why I'm even saying this now. I'm sorry. This is stupid, but can we like take a picture? Why? I don't know. In case things go bad and somebody finds it or something. Yeah, let's do it. Yeah. We're on a beach. Kind of. Well. Let's keep a shred of normal here. Alright, let's take it. Alex, get in here. I'm in here. You're not getting out of it. I don't... All right. All right. Once we're in there, the door won't open again since the system's so convoluted. So make sure you're ready to finish this before we go inside. Well, we can't... Uh, it's not like we have a lot more time left, right? So... <sighs> Close the time hole and save the day. Like, we could... Hmm. I don't know. Are we supposed to go back over the entirety of the island before going in there, or...? I feel like we are. I feel like I don't have enough information. It's supposed to work, right? But... Uh, I've just kind of been going straight for the end. Uh, I don't want a bad ending. But I also don't want time to get away from us. And I feel like that's what's happening. They said dawn, and it's probably 6, but it's already 5.30. Okay. We're just going to do it. And some people are probably like, no! But I was like, ah, I don't know, man. Hmm. We'll be back. Oh, I know. I am coming with you, you know. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. Oof. Okay. 
I... Uh, all right. <laughs> okay. Now we're never. Let's go. Enter the bomb shelter. <laughs> no one looks happy. <laughs> Six AM. Listen, Alex. I don't want to say anything to Ren or Nona, but the truth of it is I'm not feeling too awesome right now. It's kinda getting worse. Actually. Just hang in there, Jonas, okay? I know you feel like a garbage snowman right now, but we're almost done. Hopefully. Hey, what do you call a man who's short of time? Huh? Uh have you heard this one? No clue. Tim. You call him Tim. Oh. <laughs> oh. Uh, uh, yeah, it's not one of my finest. <laughs> Short of time. No, I get it, though. I get it. It's, it feels like wrong to see one of these when we're not in a, a time loop, right? <laughs> yeah, it kind of does. It's kind of spooky, right? The beds? Thinking they would have slept here while the rest of us burned? Yeah, mm. but do you think it would even have worked? Like, if... If Yugoslavia or whoever dropped an A-bomb on their heads, I don't know if this place would have held up. No, I think it would have worked. There's enough tons of concrete here to keep them from mutinying out, I think. Mm -hmm. Wait, it's... Oh, damn, it's another radio wave lock thing. Let's go all the way down here. Oh! Mm-hmm. Wait, before... Sweet. Look, uh, if something happens on the other side of this door, just... Don't be stupid. Cut and run, okay? If I turn into dead weight or start freaking out, just get to the boat. Do whatever you have to. Jonas, we're all getting out of here. All of I us. Mean, look, we're about to fix this in two minutes. Two minutes. This is microwave popcorn of a problem. I'm not asking, I'm telling. Look, dream a little dream, buddy. It's not gonna happen. I'm not gonna leave you. Now, let's just get this door open, do what we gotta, and get home. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, you know what? There's, there's like the tenth time we've heard this song all night. There is something going on with... Like, why would this specific tune be all over the place? I have to know what's going on before we head in there. Okay, if it'll make you feel better, we'll investigate the case of Jonas's mom's weird song before we save our lives. Sounds perfect. So. It's like breaking or something. Can you can you fix it? I mean, it's just so crazy to keep hearing this, right? Okay. It's it sounds like it's her. Like a recording, or it's just it's my mom. That's her voice in the static. You can hear that, right? I mean, I know you don't know what she sounded like, but you can hear that. The voice, right? Jonas, th this <sighs> It doesn't feel right. Something's wrong. Right. Wait, wait, wait. Is it possible? Do you, th do you think it's possible? I mean, we've been, like, talking with ghosts the entire night. Do you think it's... Like, it could be, right? It's just... W with everything that's happened, she could have come here. I... Jonas, I'm sorry, but I, I really don't think that's her. Like, really her. Well, how would you know? And I mean, you don't know that for sure. Well, I'm not saying I know that for sure, but... From the stuff we've seen tonight, it just... This has to be possible, right? God, she's like so close. You can just, can you just try and tune in the signal? This tape player thing isn't even, I have no clue what's going on. But if you could just help me with this right now. Uh, sure. I, I can, I can try. I guess. I guess. Yeah. Cause this, I don't know how to get this clearer or whatever. I just can't, just can't really get this to change or, uh, mom. Can you? Uh. Where is it? Mom? Whoa. Uh, no, no. Alex? No, Jonas, wait. wait.
Jonas, I need you. Come back. Come. <sighs> I, I know I screwed up. I just know that I did. Okay, so what if I climb? Oh, it won't let me. Okay. Okay. I felt like I shouldn't have, but I did. Okay, so what do I do? Did I lose Jonas as well as Clarissa? You know, the truth is, we could have left whenever we wanted. We weren't prisoners of the cave. Not in whole. Then why use my friends? Why, why are you switching with them? Why are you doing this? Because it's scary, that's why. Have you ever stared into nothing and moved with it and felt a part in it? It's worse than when we were wilting into atoms. Worse than dying the first time. I can imagine it, okay? You think contemplating annihilation makes you special? What you can imagine is a toddler's toy bag compared to facing real extinction. Don't speak to us of imagination. Okay. Whatever you think you can do, you can't. Yeah, we'll going see. Back, we won't go back. Child, we can come. We're just gonna start here, and we're going to find it. Did I do it right? <sighs> Jonas, Jonas, are you? Jonas, are you? Are you in here somewhere? Anybody? Clarissa? Yes, not. Oh boy. Okay. Um, that's a submarine. I'm on a beach underwater. I have. Well, you're gonna find out it's not that simple. Yeah, I've come to close the hole. I've come to to do what Maggie Adler tried to do 50 years ago, all right? <laughs> okay, well, it didn't work then. Why would it work now? I don't know. Uh, you're so spoiled. You don't even know the cost of things. <laughs> Closing the hole with your stupid toy will spare your, your friends from our bloom, sure. But it will seal you up in here. Yeah, I us. figured. You'll die with us. Again and again. So think long and hard about those friends. You're just trying to scare me. That isn't... That can't be the only way. One last chance. You don't have to die. You can leave, you know. Through the gate you opened. And we keep... The girl. Clarissa. Okay, you want to check out the void? Fine. We can see how long you stay on the throttle. Just don't blink. Oh, you don't want this. Then get out of everybody and I'll stop. It's everyone or nothing, girl. Understand your situation and accept it. You don't even comprehend why this is happening, do you? Nope. They sent warships after us. Like we were the... The fifth column. It's... It wasn't supposed to be like that. How can I fix it then? Just just tell me how to fix it. I'm here. I'm in the, the past, for God's sake. I can't change this somehow. No, you can't change before. You can't change anything. Okay, well. We can feel this binding. You have maybe just a few moments left. I know, I know. We terrible we do, but, but you have to know why that everyone chose to forget about us. Everyone just shuttered us away. They built a monument for you. How could you say that everyone forgot? Oh, the monument, the memorial, the 
hunk of metal. It's a bomb for their injured pride that they let one of their own fall. It won't hurt. We don't think. The chain. Oh, Sandra, wake up. This course of action will only save those morons, not yourself. Don't you understand? This isn't the road you want to be. Wait. <laughs> Ah! Oh, I guess I'm stuck in the void now. Time out. Alone. We are all on the same side. Poor, Poor girl. Joined in always. This is for my friends. Malison. Youth. It is the road of the middle. We all play by the same design. Well, I chose that route. It's not what I wanted, but I really didn't know what else to do. Uh... Work through it. Is it gonna be fine? Don't tell Michael what to do about Clarissa, okay? But Michael's dead. How could I even Whoa, wait, what what's happening? Oh, jeez. And then oh, here, right? Are you look, is someone there? Jonas? If you're still there, this would be a great time to say something. When the time comes, let Jonas talk to his mom. His mom's dead. I know his mom's dead. What is... How is this possible? What's going on? Well, that could have gone better. Right. Time loop. Tell Michael he should go out on his own. What does this... What does this matter? He's dead. He's not... He's not here. I... Was I supposed to match them with what I was saying before? Because I don't think I did. What? Oh, so I was the one on the other side. Dead face. Oh, I am so confused right now. Is that Michael? <laughs> oh, hey, I didn't even know you were home. You're always so quiet. It's like living with a little fairy tale mouse. Wait, did I get booted back in time? I know, I haven't used this desk in like a year, but Dad has all his gear on the kitchen table, so I've been like struggling with this stupid speech, the graduation thing. I don't want it to be just the usual blah blah we've come so far type stuff. It should have like a point, right? It should bring you to your feet about something. Uh, sure, yeah. Give it a theme. I'm guessing mm. mom probably told you about my scholarship to state, right? I don't really know how I feel about it. I mean, I feel it's not like it's a bad thing. It's a good thing, obviously. What is it? Don't want to go? Like, are you thinking of another school or? Nah, it'd be that school if it was going to be a school. It's just, you know, it seems like half the teachers are alumni, and... Actually, I'm about to be really arrogant and presumptuous and say mean things for no real reason other than I think I know better, so forget it. I've bored you enough. You're boring <laughs> me right now. No, 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 keep going. It's fine. I hate people, too. Yeah. You can rag on the town. What, you think the teachers are wasting their lives? Well, they are wasting their lives. <laughs> All right, okay, thank you, but really, never mind. It had nothing to do with anything. 
Listen, here's the... <sighs> you can't tell mom or dad, but Clarissa and I are talking about just leaving. Getting an apartment somewhere and... and just doing our own thing, you know? Getting... What? Mike, you're kidding me, right? I mean, I know you said you were gonna commit or whatever, but isn't running off like you're in Badlands taking it a bit far? Oh, come on. It's not that crazy. She's been really pushing for it, wanting to look for places, and, uh, I'm into the idea. I really am. I just... I wouldn't feel right about it if I didn't have your, like, blessing first. So, can you just wave your hand over my head or something and say I'm all right to do this? Uh, Michael, honestly, I don't think it matters. Or, or it, it doesn't matter what I think, at least. It matters to me. Alex, just get good friends, okay? And when you're with those friends, just say yes to everything. And keep away from boys when you talk to them. It feels like you're performing. But also, stay away from girls who look you in the eye for too long. And match every beer with a water. <laughs> and take classes outside of school. Classes you don't need. Michael, what is... What's this for? What, what are you doing? This is just... This is a just-in-case package, okay? Just in case I'm not around. And I love you, and you're amazing, and that's it. So... I love you, too. But soon... I shall be so I cannot remember any, but the things that never happened. Yeah, I... I don't know. Hey, she's waking up. Ugh. Maybe don't get up immediately. Ugh. Ouch. Is, um... <clears throat> is everyone doing alright? Still, um, yourselves? Yeah, I think we're all accounted for, right? Yeah, my arm fell asleep, Jonas but... carried you here. Yeah, he said you were heavier than you looked. Oh, yeah, yeah, great. Yeah. Okay. The the important thing is whatever you did in the cave, it worked. Did it? The tear the hole, it's fixed. The ghosts are gone. We're going home. Is that right? Or at least they've they've stopped trying to eat our souls. Yeah, it's important to note that. Jonas, what happened to you in the shelter? I was so I just saw you disappear. I didn't I didn't know what to think. What happened? I thought I heard my mom. And when Alex, when we tried to tune into this signal, I was I don't know what it looked like from your end, but it was like I'd fallen into a memory with my dad. I don't know. I'm sorry. I shouldn't have set us off course or whatever. I think... Jonas, I think that was your dad. Like, it was real. You were back then. That's... I mean, it felt real, so... I don't know. Maybe. When I was under them, I had something like that, too. Did anyone else... Did anyone... I'm sorry, but like... Did anyone have dreams or whatever about the past when they were, uh, taken during the night? Um, yeah. Yeah, a few. Just, um, just the one, I think. I saw, um, Michael a, a few times back when we were here on a kind of an accidental trip. So Michael visited you. He crawled out from whatever netherworld swamp he's in and plucked into your head? Maybe it's... I don't know, maybe it's like what matters to us showed up or something. The universe doesn't care about what matters to us. Then it doesn't matter anyway. No, I guess it doesn't. I can't believe everything that happened. I just... I feel like we should tell everyone we know. Like, go on a freaking book tour, but... I think we'd sound nuts, honestly. Yeah. I, I mean, it's not like... It's not like we have any proof any of this actually happened. Is this... Rin, didn't you lose a book? Holy crap! This is it! Thank you! I lost it on the way. I thought for sure some commuter would have just tossed it overboard. Hey, or... that reminds me. What were we... We were talking about something stupid right before Alex woke up. Prom? Uh, uh, prom. Prom. <laughs> I am definitely prom? skipping this one. I'm deferring the crown to that wheelchair girl. Are mm. you going, Alex? Are we supposed to still spike the punch or just bring in flasks? I mean, do they even have punch? Uh, I guess... I mean, if I find a date, you know, I'm not going to go stag. I have my dignity. Ben <laughs> Owens will ask you. Or rather, he's going to ask you unless I physically prevent him. Eh, you can do better. All right, <laughs> you know what? It's picture time. Oh, my God. Is come it? On. No, no. Oh, come on. What? We earned this one. Yeah, totally. <sighs> yeah, I guess we should. Tonight's been, um, noteworthy. Noteworthy. That is a way to say it. Yeah, I'd probably say it another way. Let's, um, let's actually move outside so we can get the light. Sure. Ren, what is that book, anyway? I don't know. I can hardly make heads or tails out of what the hell he's talking about half the time. 
Here's good for the yeah, just here. I don't want to stand next like, to. Look, I'll just pick a random ass page. Come on, two seconds. Like this here. When I was younger, I could remember anything, whether it happened or not. But soon, I shall be so I cannot remember any, but the things that never happened. Yeah, I, I don't know. Okay, everyone. Wait, didn't you? Cheese. No, wait. I think I got the bad ending. Before we'd left, I told my mom I was spending the night at a friend's house. And when I got back, I didn't see any reason to change that story. And you know what? I still don't. Ren always loved the town, but the island pretty much erased that in one fell swoop. He ended up going to college in California. He was my best friend, but I don't know if I'll ever see him again. You and 30% of players kept Ren and Nona from dating. Ah, I didn't want to keep him from dating. Nona, I think, is going to some ballet academy somewhere, but I kind of fell out of touch with her, to be honest. Clarissa fled to the East Coast, dropped out of college, and works at a boutique. I mm. hear she's scared of the ocean now. Um, sure. You and 25% of players made Clarissa hate you. <laughs> Clarissa already hated me, whatever. Jonas was the first to introduce me as his sister. You know, without the step part in front of it. Mm. And it was weird at first, but it's the truth. He's my brother. He goes to school in town, and we see each other a lot. That's nice. 61% of players bonded with your new stepbrother, Jonas. It's funny. What happened on the island used to pop into my head every single day. And then every other day. And then a week went by and I realized I hadn't thought about it at all. I guess that's... I don't know. It's good, I think. I think that's but good. anyways, I, um... Well... If it matters. I decided to stay in town and go to college here. It's practically up the road. And why? I just wanted something familiar. I why? Guess. No, what I do? But what? Anyways, oh, what time is it? <gasps> yeah, sorry, I gotta run or I'll miss the ferry. Ren's dragging me out to Edwards Island for that yearly beach party thing. And I have to pick up what's his name Jonas, too. <sighs> I hope he's not weird or mean or something. Whatever. I'm sure it'll be fun. It's something to do. Right? Oh, I hate this. Oh, it's so unsettling. What? What did I just play? A video game that I night school, of course. Ah, uh, I don't know what's right and wrong. <laughs> it's a very interesting game. So... So if I'm to believe what happened, I saved everyone, but at the end, her voice kind of changed, so maybe I didn't and this is all, like, not real? Like the end of Inception. Uh, I, don't, I don't know what to think. All I know is that I didn't get all the anomalies. And I feel like I should have. So this is one of... I don't know. I don't know how many endings there are, but... I just feel like there... There was a lot that I've missed. I felt like I was against the clock at the end. That's why I kind of rushed the ending there because the time it just kept going I didn't know what time um, uh, what time sunrise was or or if moving around the island would have made time go f um, uh, keep going forward it's just it's so mysterious I don't know. I don't know what happened. And then when when Alex tuned the radio to 
to close the gate from the other side and then suddenly she's back on her side but that does that make sense I don't know oh there's so much Okay, and there's the picture on the boat again. Nothing seems out of place. Does that mean everything's fine or what? Anything here at the end? No? Okay, yeah. That is just one ending of Oxenfree. Certainly thrilling. Uh, very unsettling. Especially at the end there. I feel like I didn't get the ending that I wanted. There's a lot of loose ends. I just know there are. <sighs> That's okay. I'll explore them another day. Well, yeah. Thank you all for watching. I really appreciate it. Be sure to like and subscribe and do all the YouTube things. Hope you really enjoyed that playthrough of Oxenfree. I did really enjoy the game, even though I'm a little confused and unnerved at the end. But yeah. You guys can... If you've played this game before, you guys can tell me everything that I've done wrong. <laughs> I'm, I'm open to... I don't know. Spoilers, I guess? I don't know. Or I'll just ignore you and play it on my own. We'll see. I've got, I've got my entire life. <laughs> Thanks again. And I'll see y'all in the next one. Later.